with us, as we can see. If you have any question, please raise your hand. Scott Merkin, go ahead, Mark. Hello, you seem to be in pretty good spirits in your uh, comeback today. How, how excited, how, many, how long have you been excited for this and when did you feel like you were ready to come back? <laughs> I'm a face. You look happy. Uh, well, I feel really excited, you know, to be back uh, with the boys. Um, I don't know. I can't explain right now how I feel. James. Uh, we can hear you, James. No, nothing. <laughs> Come on, man, figure it out. Let's try with Cheryl. Go ahead, Cheryl. Hi, Eloy. How are you? I'm good. I'm good, too. Eloy, how was the meeting when you joined the team? What was it like? What were the players like? What were they saying? What were they doing? Well, they are happy that I'm here and I'm happy to be with them, you know? Uh, everybody here, uh, they were excited to have me here. So I am really appreciate that. Um, so I'm totally happy with being back uh, with the boys. And um, like I say, right now, I cannot explain how I feel. Do you have to be careful that you're, you're too excited? Or do you have to control your emotions a little bit because of your situation? Uh, I need to control it, you know, but uh, it's normal to be like that. Like, and uh, that was what happened in stream training. And now I'm completely bad from, from what happened. So. I'm really, 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 really excited. <laughs> nice day, I'll be back. Thanks. Thank you. Vinny? Hey, Eloy, how are you? <laughs> hey, Tony LaRusso was saying last night that, uh, you know, the team, the team made a commitment to be contenders, to be in contention by the time you got back. How impressed have you been by what they've been able to do, not only without you, but without Luis and without Madrigal and without Yasmani? Well, you know, uh, I want to congrats the guys here because they put the effort every single day, every single night, you know. Uh, we're all, what happened with a couple of players, uh, you know, now uh, it's been it's been like impressive why they done every single night and i um, feel like really excited to join and uh just continue to play hard and uh win some games for you how exciting is it to be back with a team that is in first place and has a chance to to really kind of accomplish the goals that you set out in the preseason for me <laughs> Look at my face. What well, my face tell you right now, you know? Uh, it's, it's exciting, you know, to be back with the boys, especially how they're playing right now. It's amazing, you know? I'm, I'm right now really excited. Uh, I'm happy that I'm back. And, uh, you know, and every single one of the guys, they, they were it were really hard to be where we are right now. James, let's try it again. Let's try it. Oh uh, yes. Nice. Eloy, just uh how do you feel how was rehab? How do you feel at the plate? Do you feel like yourself? Do you feel like Eloy yet? Uh, yes. <laughs> you know it was a long process but I'm finally back. I feel 100%, well, 200% right now. Uh, I'll be working hard. So it was long, but finally I'm here. 
do you feel like this experience has changed you as a player at all, or do you feel like you'll have to be more careful going forward, or do you think you'll be the same guy? I'm just going to play hard no matter what happened before, you know, because what happened was in the past. I need to move forward and just keep playing hard and uh, try to win some games. Lamont. Yeah, Eli, just what was it like walking into the clubhouse knowing that three half was over and you're back with the team? <sighs> excited. <laughs> it's excited, you know, uh, all the process and uh, finally be with the club. Uh, it's, it's excited. Daryl? Loy, uh, are you DHing today? I don't know yet. You've talked about that before. It's, it's not uh, your favorite subject, I know, because you, you don't like to DH, but um, are you <laughs> <laughs> are you prepared and, and willing to do that if that's what the uh, manager asks you to do part-time anyway? Well, if he asks me, I'm here for my team, you know. Uh, even if I don't like it, uh, I need to be for my team. It was for me uh, when I was rehabbing. So now I'm finally back and I'm for them. So whatever he want me to play, I'm, I'm going to be here. When, when did you uh, have your timing back? We hear that a lot, that when guys are off for a long time, they need to get uh, their timing back. When was it back for you? Well, last week. <laughs> yeah, last week. Uh, I feel really comfortable at the place. So let's see today. You, you get to a point like a week ago where you say, okay, let's go. You know, I'm ready. Uh, can, can we do this now? Can, can I get back to the team? Or did you, you just wait to hear back from them and kind of roll with whatever their decision is? Oh, I just wait, you know, uh, and they just tell me Saturday after the game. And uh, now I'm here. Bruce? All of your uh, managers and hitting coaches in the minor leagues, you like, said that everybody ate very well because you were there. They said you were very generous. Uh, what was that experience like going back to the minor leagues and kind of reliving what, what you had already gone through? Uh, the experience go minor league again. Uh, it was fun, you know. Uh, I have a lot of memories when I was playing there. Um, especially in Winston Salem, that was when I got trade, first team that I played for um, as a White Sox uh, player, you know. And and it was it was excited to play there, you know. Yeah, Miles. Hey, Aloy, I know, I know you're clearly very, very excited. I'm just curious as to when was the last time you were this excited? Last time? <laughs> well, uh, last time was... Uh, I, what was, when was my first game back? Last year? No, my first game back by this year. It was like two weeks ago. Mm -hmm like three weeks ago. Yeah, but now I'm more excited, you know. Like like this, I don't think I'm like have like that yet. I just today I guess. I remember. But in the, in the past I don't I don't remember if in the past I was like that, but today I'm <laughs> really, 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 really excited. Is that more about you just being healthy or being healthy and coming at this time when you guys are making such a hard push uh, towards the playoffs? Both. Both, yeah. Because I'm healthy. Uh, I'm healthy in the like how the team is playing right now is getting me more excited, you know? James? Yeah, Luis Roberts said it was uh... – 
it was really important to rehab together with you that you guys really helped each other get through it. Um, how did he help you? Uh, well, you know, Robert and me have a really good uh, com like communication. So uh, I wasn't happy because he was there because I want him to play like here every single day. But at the same time, I was happy to be with him because we help each other out every single day. Like even if we don't wanna like go out and work out, like we say, let's go. We have a mission to do it, you know? So that's how he helped me uh, when he was, when we was together. What did, what did the uh, kind of demonstration Jose Abreu did uh, after you got hurt mean to you as far as, you know, wearing his, your red gloves in his back pocket? Well, for me, that was special, you know, uh, I was, I was down a little bit, but when I saw that, I, that's, that's going to be like, right now, I'm a little bit emotional for that, but uh, it, it was, it was good, you know, I feel like he supported me a lot, a lot of my team supported me a lot, but he was there every single day, every single night to help me to get through it, you know? So I'm more than like appreciated for him, you know? It's kind of like my big brother. So uh, he always was for me. So I'm really appreciated. I'm on. Hey, like just uh, what did you miss the most and what are you most looking forward to? Well, what I miss the most, uh, I was playing, <laughs> playing with my boys, you know. And uh, what I'm looking for is keep playing hard, keep winning games, and make it to the playoffs. Bruce? Uh, Eli, I know you've uh, spent a lot of time on your defense. We saw a couple of really great throws that you made in the minor leagues. Where do you think you're at out there as far as uh, wanting to be uh, at the top level uh, on defense? Tu defensa, ¿cómo te sientes tú con con tu defensa? Obviamente, él dice que vio que hiciste tuviste buenas jugadas en las menores, para ti los buenos y eso. ¿Cómo crees tú que tu defensa va a estar ahora en tu regreso? Oh, good. I'm feeling good out there. Uh, I have a lot of confidence back. And I feel good. Okay, guys, now we're transferred to the Spanish. Uh, Dioniso Soldavila. Saludos, hello. Hey, eh, regresas a un equipo de los Medias Blancas del que estuviste fuera durante cuatro meses. De la, eh, originalmente, los Medias Blancas temían que tú perdieras de cinco meses en adelante. Eh, ¿Qué tan satisfactorio es volver eh, con tanta anticipación? Bueno, para mí eso eh, ha sido algo maravilloso. Creo que es una bendición de que estoy de vuelta, ¿me entiendes? Y en, de vuelta en el tiempo que nadie esperaba que yo estuviera de vuelta. En verdad, eh, me siento muy agradecido de Dios y muy agradecido con el trabajo que tuve. Y Gracias, yo estamos aquí. Te lastimaste jugando un partido de entrenamiento de primavera, quizás siendo muy agresivo. Eh, ¿Pretende bajarle algo al juego luego de experimentar esto y haberte lesionado de la manera que lo hiciste? En verdad, no le pudiera bajar porque si le bajo, estoy cambiando mi juego. En verdad, yo tengo que seguir jugando duro, no importa lo que haya pasado, ¿me entiendes? Eh, lo que seguí aprendiendo de los errores y, y seguí jugando fuerte. ¿Vas a jugar defensa de inmediato o el plan es ir poco a poco? Todavía no me han dicho. Eh, todavía no me han dicho exactamente cómo va a ser la cosa. Eh, esperemos estar en el outfield, pero si no, eh, estamos más contentos de, de, de hacer el trabajo donde sea. Carlos Parra. 
¿Qué tan emocionante es para ti encontrar a los medios blancas en los de la división No, 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 ¿Me entiendes? Está de primero es algo emocionante porque eh, por eso fue que trabajamos, eh, para eso fue que trabajamos en, en los entrenamientos y todo el mundo está, poniendo, está aportando algo y eso es lo importante. Carlos Parra. Eloy, este, felicitaciones por tu regreso y te pregunto, eh, ¿qué, ¿qué aprendiste? de tu, el tiempo que estuviste haciendo la rehabilitación eh, desde, el, desde el inicio de la temporada hasta el día de hoy. ¿Cuáles fueron las enseñanzas que tuviste sobre esa experiencia, Eloy? Que hay que trabajar duro. Eh, no importa lo que diga la otra persona de ti. Eh, tú tienes que trabajar acorde a lo que tú quieres en la vida. Eso fue la, importancia, la enseñanza más grande que, que yo aprendí en estos últimos cuatro meses. Para ti, me imagino que fue una dura noticia eh, la lesión que tuviste en los entrenamientos. ¿Creíste que ibas a estar a este momento de la temporada ya ready para jugar en la temporada? Eh, en verdad, ¿qué te digo? Al principio no me sentía con ese ánimo, ¿me entiendes? Porque fue, fue algo faltando una semana para, para el pin training, o sea, para, para acabar el pin training. Y pasarme eso así, eso me puso un poco down, pero al final yo me puse en mi mente que yo quería estar para este mes y gracias a Dios lo logré. ¿Cuál crees tú que va a ser el aporte de Eloy Jiménez para la causa de las medias blancas en lo que queda de temporada? Bueno, seguí trabajando duro. En verdad, el aporte mío va a ser tanto fuera del terreno como dentro del terreno. Eh, de traerle más alegría de lo que tiene el equipo, que eso es lo importante, estar alegre y jugar fuerte. ¿Qué te dijeron tus compañeros cuando te recibieron en el Clubhouse? En verdad que están muy emocionados de tenerme de vuelta y, y yo estoy muy, muy emocionado de estar aquí con ellos también. ¿Cómo fue tu primer game back feel? Todo bien. Uh, you know, I was a little bit extra excited, but I I'm feel I'm feel really good. I see the ball good, so yeah, it was good to be back. You were asked pregame, you know, when you kind of got your timing back. Do you think it'll take you a little bit just to adjust, considering the amount of time you missed and, and how long it's been since you faced the you know big league pitching? Uh I think it's it's there, you know. And I see the ball good. I'm, I was just Super excited, and uh, I hit the ball. <laughs> that is the most important thing that I hit the ball, you know. So I'm feel pretty good. I think I'm I gonna be back soon, like just couple couple games, and, and I'm gonna be there. James, when you come up in that sixth inning uh, RBI opportunity, just how much uh, you know excitement is kind of coursing through you? Well, I feel really excited. Uh, I think that's why I, I'm chasing those pitches because I wasn't like, I was in the middle of excited and concentrate, you know, but um, in that inning, we, We've been good, you know. Uh, so I'm, I'm feel like those moments gonna keep coming. So I'm gonna be ready for those. James, did it feel good just to kind of be in that moment to have that excitement again, even if you you weren't able to come through? Yeah, it felt good. You know, it was it was good. You know, um, to feel that. Again, uh, and that that uh, adrenaline is is feel good, you know. So 
from from now on just I just need to concentrate and uh not let the the game spirit out of me. Right. Hello, you played a uh, number of games in your minor league rehab. Just I know you played a number of major league games, but how much different did tonight feel compared to you know some of the games you've been going through at Charlotte and Winston Salem? Well, I'm facing the best pitchers in the world, you know. So uh, it's it's a little bit different. Uh, yeah, the game the game here can speed it on you, but like more than than minor league. Uh, what you say? It's the same. Like I think it's the same game. You know, they need to throw strikes and they need to come to the zone. So, um, and just let the game speed it on me a little bit. I was too excited, but from now on, I just need to control that. Thank mm -hmm. you.